Yes, hello my friends and um, I hope everybody has had a good day, a nice day and a bright day. Well, I'm uh, trying to get around and go around see my garden and see how it is really going and how to notice how everything is really moving. And if you see, now we have 99% cover. 99% cover of net. Our floating net has been completed as you have been following. We are done with our floating net and um, we are providing support for our crops as you may see. Yeah, we are providing support. This is 100% organic uh, passion fruit farming. And we are not using any other fertilizers, artificial or what. We are only doing it organic. As you may see, some of our, of our crops have already flowered. They are showing they are having flowers. This is one of them, as you might see. Yeah. So, basically what I wanted to show you was how the net is done and how it is done for the first phase of starting up a passion fruit farm the first phase is putting the crops in the ground or planting we have over 500 stems here of passion fruits and uh, you can see they're doing well and uh, after the netting okay we clear the ground now planted after planting we did the netting the weaving of the net we have done our net and if you look at the quality if you look at the quality of the thread these are uh, uh, fish net threads which you acquire from the local market and the weaving is done by hand by man okay not machines we have not used machines but we, when you look around if you manage to look around no it is so firm it's a nice one it's a nice net uh, so reliable very strong can go so many seasons except those other uh, already made nets so we we stick on to this procedure to provide the support for our passion fruits now um, so you can see some of our crops have not been given support yet but that's okay because we needed to first make what is giving support all right so um i just want to show you how the net is and how it has been done and how everybody is so excited about how it has been done and how it looks because if you see it it looks like a shed and uh, it, it is really good okay it's really good and strong very tight you may see very tight no very tight net so we are really going to see uh, the changes that we are having among us the, these crops that are already given support like this one okay it also has fruit uh, it also has flowers it started flowering yes okay but uh you notice that once they are given support they are moving up fast okay they are moving up fast and uh, it's so it's so interesting and everybody is so excited about this kind of progress okay please stay sub pre 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 stay subscribed to this channel and uh, enjoy because we are giving you every stage of starting up a passion fruit farm please subscribe like and follow our channel uh, you will like our our programs and our issues on uh, how to go about starting a passion fruit farm our issues are coming in i think this is the sixth or seventh issue yeah you may like it and um it is very important that you keep on following if you are uh, trying to start up a passion fruit farm i for one want to wish you a very good holiday weekend weekday as you watch this uh, video but please stay subscribed to this channel thank you